Commander Shogun, 1953-3. I'm at a Guardian structure site. This particular site has Guardian module blueprints. And I'm going to show you the quickest way around to get the blueprints and the materials needed to build those modules. Right here, that little triangle, that's where the orbs are going to come out that we need that holds the blueprints. And right here, that X on the ground is where you need to drop the relic that releases the orb. I like to land close to the site. That way my point of defense help protect my protect me from the sentries and their rockets. This is a good point to check to see how many rounds of ammo you got. Make sure you have enough. I've got 1,940. That should be enough. 2,000 is full. We can get in a turret. Because right here is where a sentry going to pop up. Destroyed. It's a blisk, you can scan it. Just to target it and scan it. That's where you get all your blisk data. The uh, sentry dropped these sentinel weapons parts, wrecking components, and others. You can pick those up if you need them. What you hear now is a tower. I hear it with the relic. I usually don't mess with that one. Back in the turret. Get these construction panels. There's three of them on each one of these. Power cells. I think there's two power cells on this one. And the third. The third panel has power conduit. Power cell, power cell, and conduit. And this is the orb I'm going to get. Cargo scoop deployed. I'm not orb, uh, relic. Okay, you see the square right there? Okay, right there where the square is, there there's rocks that's going to bind you up. So you go to either left or right of those. Go ahead and get your turret. It goes right on here. 
going to be another either pop up here or he's going to pop up over there. No, he popped up over there. <coughs> Components you can pick up. Yeah, the like I said, he'll either pop up right, right here at that dark spot, or he'll pop up over here right at that dark spot there. Another blisk you can scan. Right here, this is going to be a pylon we need later. Get these panels. And there's one more on the back side. Right here. This one. Backside, get the other one. Pick up those components if you need them. <clears throat> then I go over this berm on this side here get close to the structure here because you've got rocks on the left side over here. Go ahead and get in your turret. Target destroyed. Destroy him. Pick up those materials if you need them. Another blisk you scan. I have most of them. I just, uh, Epsilon's on the ones I need, which is hard to find. This right here is another pylon we're going to need later. Acceptable panels. Go to the other side. Another panel. And go to the left over here. Start over this berm, go ahead and get in your turret. Go over the berm. Gonna be another one popping over right by here. These three here always carry Guardian power cells. You get three Guardian power cells out of this one. Two there. Got the other side. One. Around here, over here. 
Two power conduits out of this one, and then the other one is going to have a power cell. They turn over it. I'll go ahead and get this blisk, scan it. When you get the turret, swing around, get your power cell back up. Okay, if you can see right, right here, there's another pylon you're going to need. Get it later. <clears throat> now we need to go to the other side. Do not go up this way. You will get hung up. Go up this way. Knock these out. You can get two power cells, and I do not remember what the third one is. Power conduit. Okay. Just to the left of the right, if you look to the left, you can see another pylon. We're going to go this way. Whoops, got on up. So we're going to get over the berm, turn to the right, left. That's an X on the ground. I don't know where that is. And we're going to have a couple of sentries shooting at us. So we need to take care of them. There's one right here. Down to the left. That is why I like having my ship close point fan taking care of those rockets. Target destroyed. As soon as we pulled up, this pylon came up. Okay, that's gonna be another pylon here, remember, the one here. We need to get them to up so we get down here, over here. Here it coming up over on this side. Here it coming up. You see it coming up right there. Going down here. <clears throat> There's another one right here. Go to this side over here because you know you get hung up on that pylon. Go you get hung up on that if you go to the right. shoot these and you need to shoot them in here. All the bullets have to hit in there or it will not st start. Need to 
rush, you got plenty of time. Every time you raise one, the time to add it to the timer. do it in this order, just this order I do it in, I'm used to doing it this way, I find it a little quicker. Okay, now we got another save, remember I said don't go over to the left right there, go up this way, because you'll get hung up if you go the other way. As soon as we get this one done, that's going to be a sentry. It's going to be pop up right here, another one right here, and two more back there in the back. One on this side, one on this side. The two in the back we won't worry about. They they won't unless you want the the materials they drop. I only mess with them. Now the orb, when the orb gets done, sometimes there's one to pop up on this side or this side. It's kind of hit and miss whether or not it pop up. It doesn't matter the way you abandon or jettison, it doesn't matter. Behind us. Usually it's just two. 
this time it's three. You can go back there and fight them and get pick up the materials or just ignore them. I usually just ignore them. Go back to the ship. Okay, now you can go exit, main menu, go escape, exit, main menu. And then continue. You log back back in, start all over again, do it all over again until you get all you, everything you need. Uh, good luck.